If you have ever used Google Earth or a world map or a globe, you'll see that there are a bunch of these islands all across the planet that are close to the continents that are on or around the continental shelves or perhaps in the middle of an ocean. And there's a collection of these islands. Now, there's a geographical term for these islands in a group or a chain or a large number of islands, and that is called archipelago. Now, this word comes from the Greek language that means chief or principal, that's archi, and pelagos means sea, lake, or pond. So basically, you're looking at the piece of land that is located in water, which denotes an island. But there are multiple islands in a geographical area based on a certain country's borders, and therefore, it is called a certain country's archipelago. Now, some countries are, in essence, an archipelago, like Japan. And some countries, like in Europe, in Finland, they have the most amount of islands in its country of 40,000. The U.S. has a state that's just an archipelago, which is Hawaii, a bunch of volcanic islands in a long chain, and also the Florida Keys. In the Caribbean or Caribbean, you have the Lesser Antilles, or you have areas like Puerto Rico, which are an archipelago, which is a form of oceanic islands, which is separated away from the main continents. Or you might have continental fragments, which is an archipelago, which is basically formed through tectonics, where you have bits of land that are separated from the, from the mainland or the continent through tectonic activity. Then you might have continental islands as another type, which are part of the Cornell Shelf, both fragments and islands. The Cornell Shelf is the area of the continent that is submerged underwater, but it's still attached. So if the sea level was to drop during an ice age, perhaps they would be reconnected to the continents. And an example of an island archipelago would be the British Isles, my home area, or Tasmania in or off the coast of Australia, and the Arctic Canadian archipelago, those bunch of islands in the northern part of Canada. So an archipelago is a naturally occurring bunch of islands or collection of islands close or near to the continents and comes in three different types, oceanic islands, continental islands, and continental fragments.